はい、ガブレーラさん、あの YouTube チャンネルに参加ありがとうございます。こちらこそ<笑>誘っていただいてありがとうございます。よろしくお願いします。よろしくお願いします。自己紹介お願いします。<笑>はいはい。<笑>えっと初めまして。ガブリエラと申します。大阪に住んでるイタリア人です。よろしくお願いいたします。<笑>ああ、よろしくお願いします。えっ、ー、と、ガブリエラさん、なんで日本に住もうと思ったんですかえっ、ー、と、私が、うん、12歳の時、うん、初めて家族と一緒に日本に来て、日本に本当に感動しました。えー、その旅行してから日本語や日本の伝統に興味を持ちました。今何年ぐらい住んでます、うん、?6 年半になりました、うん。すごいですね。その6年前、日本に住もうと思った時怖くなかったですか怖くなかったけど、ちょっと、まあ、悩んだところ、うん、それは、うん、<笑>ありました。まあ、仕事を見つけられる、うん。とかあのいや新しい友達できるかとかちょっとだけ悩んでましたうん,うんでもすごいですね6年うんで今何やってるんですか日本ではい今、うんえー、イタリア語を教えております素晴らしい、うん、So first of all ガブレラさん I really amazed how you improved do, during the master course congratulations Thank you so much. Thank you so much. I cannot say by myself because、uh, for me it was a natural process. So,、mm. of course, I'm feeling much better, much more confident than before.、Mm. When someone s a y that, I'm like, oh, really?、Mm. <laughs> I'm still, I can't believe it. <laughs>、mm. So,、uh, a little bit, can you、uh, um, introduce like,、uh, what actually you have done before during the master course and then what kind of level you had? Yeah, yeah. Before joining Japan Language Factory, I had already studied one year in a school for Japanese language for foreigners.、Uh, and before that, I had already、uh, Japanese、um, language proficiency number three.、Mm. I entered the school, I graduated from the school, and I tried the、uh, Japanese、uh, proficiency, proficiency test level two. Mm. You meant- passed JLPT N2. I did. I did. Wow. That's the- so I had, as you said, I had knowledge, but <laughs> I wasn't able to speak. <laughs>、mm-hmm. Yeah. So that's why I sometimes、uh, explain to the foreigner that it's what is JLPT? What is the you know, benefit of taking JLPT?、Yeah. And what is the benefit of doing our training is if、mm. you know, like a, you imagine, like a, the somebody who just like Japan in living in Italy w a n t to start Japanese, have no idea what they do. You know, first maybe they think I have to do JLPT. That's actually a common idea that、mm-hmm. because it's everybody, you know, think that it's、uh, if I take proficiency, I'm gonna be able to do a lot of things.、Mm. So, It's, it's true for writing or reading, but so what do you think for, by experiencing? And also, if let's say this listener, somebody is、uh, still thinking to start Japanese and what should I do? What is the first step? Do you have、yeah. any advice by experiencing the whole, you know, both of them, you know, JLPT and also you did、yeah. this master course too? Well, of course,、uh, um, everything that you study can be useful at a certain point.、Mm. <laughs> okay. So、of、let's、course. start from general. <laughs> yes, exactly. But if you live in Japan as I do, or if you want to make friends, if you don't live in Japan, but you want to travel in Japan to Japan, or you want to make friends with Japanese people, the first thing you need to do is to speak.、Mm. So the nowadays, tests like JLPT don't help you at all to learn how to speak.、Mm. Because all the things you are going to do in those tests are listening and uh, um, multiple choice mm. Uh, mm, exercises, meaning that you understand. So, your understanding, your listening, you can improve a little bit your listening, you can、uh, improve your reading, I want to say reading Japanese,、mm. but it doesn't mean you are going to be able to use the, those knowledge.、Mm. Uh, 
um, that's because the difference between, for example, Italian language or English and Japanese is so huge mm. that you have to, how can I say, <laughs> fill the gap mm. using the language. If you don't use the language, everything is on your mind, but you cannot speak. When you try mm. to speak, you don't know where those knowledge are in your mind. So you have to stop. You have to look for them. You have to, mm. and then you try to say a word and it's wrong. Then you say another word and it's wrong. And <laughs> it takes a lot of time. So uh, you need um, to train. You need mm. to train on uh, how to speak. And you have to practice. Mm. So knowing the grammar and speaking Japanese language are two completely different things and mm. even living in Japan and can speak Japanese language can, sometimes can be two different things mm. <laughs> so you really have to focus on the language you, you really need to know how to do mm. so unless you are surrounded just by Japanese and the, the only choice is to <laughs> try to speak <laughs> language but it's not reality because mm. we know as a foreigner uh, for example I teach Italian so I can mm. keep on using my language and I have foreign friends mm. so the reality is not that I just use Japanese language in Osaka mm. for mm. example so yeah uh, so this uh, this answer is going to be <laughs> a little bit long but yeah um, yeah if you want to speak Japanese don't go for uh, a test Mm. I've written. Mm -mm -mm. So, like uh, by experiencing, you know, JLPT and two, and then now you finish the master course level one. And then, um, <laughs> but what do you think it's uh the what was the huge differences between JLPT study to our uh, Japan language factory master course? Um, uh, what what do you think? What was the huge differences between uh, the 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 JLPT, course? I... Yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. And then... Well, uh, Japan Language Factory course is uh, fun and I learn a lot of things that I'm using in my everyday life. So at the end of the lesson, after five minutes, I was 10 minutes, I was using the words I had learned in the lessons because I was focusing on the things I need. So daily life and teaching Italian language. So finished the, the lesson, went to the school, start teaching Italian, and boom, <laughs> I could use a word, an expression that I had learned uh, with uh, Chihiro or my son or uh, Shinobu-san. And it was great because uh, I could see the, the a different reaction. I could see the reaction of my students. Before I had tried to explain the same thing in my broken Japanese or in some way in Italian, and their reaction was, hmm, and then using that specific word, that specific ex expression, their reaction was completely different and uh, it was rewarding. It was fun. It was motivating. It was useful. Um, how can I say? How many uh, <laughs> uh, nice thing I can say? I don't know. It's like this because after so many years, uh, finally, I felt, oh, I'm speaking Japanese. <laughs> I'm saying the thing in the right way. <laughs> I can interact with people. I was I wanted to cry. So there was a huge difference between studying Japanese uh, proficientist, uh, Japan language proficient test. <laughs> mm. <laughs> and mm. What do you think? Because it's, you know, a, a lot of people study Japanese only academic way which is a textbook study with the JLPT. And then when the people see uh, our master course is speaking Japanese in two months, how how these things happen, right? Mm -hmm. So what do you think, what kind of actually training specifically help you to really suddenly start using it right after 10 minutes? Mm -hmm. Uh focusing on one topic and training training as much as i could mm -hmm. that was uh, um the the turning point the moment that okay yeah okay i know something i can use the language i'm using the language wow i'm improving mm -hmm. <laughs> good escalation so i was really happy to join this master class because it was different finally I found something more similar to what I wanted to. Uh, I always was had been looking for. 
I didn't know anything about the method, but definitely I was looking for a conversation uh, class. Definitely I was looking for a way to make some progress. And the most amazing, one of the most amazing thing was when I woke up on a day and I was like, okay, now I, I see how to go from the point where I am now to the point where I want to go. <laughs> amazing Gabriela san so like uh you already uh, encourage other uh, uh uh japanese learner in japanese but it's uh, can you tell one more time encouragement uh to 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 tell the world if somebody or especially as a representative of italian person uh, if somebody really want to learn japanese do you have any uh, message to them in english <laughs> mm -hmm. okay yeah Go for Japan Language Factory. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much. まあ、素晴らしい。ありがとうございます。本当に素晴らしい。ガブレラさん、ありがとうございます。あの、ちょ、ちょっとミニレッスンしてもらってもいいですかイタリア語レッスン、ちょっとしてもらってもいいですか私